new keychain and massive fireworks display. Then Mickey appears at either the top of the mountain or the cabin. There's more fountains, fireworks, pyrotechnics, the lake's on fire again, but this time that's a good thing. And hey, what the hell, Disney? We can't use laser pointers, but you can? Then Mickey appears back down on the island. Okay, that is it. I was willing to blame his personality change on a weird drug-induced bipolar disorder, but this? Th no! He's on a boat, then on a high place, and then a low place? The turns is in! Oh, what? Are you trying to imply there's more than one Mickey at these parks? What? No. Don't be absurd. Mickey's a ninja. Oh, come on. Mickey is not a ninja. Spending too much time at Disney parks doesn't just give you the power to magically transport from one place to another. That is an absolutely insane theory with absolutely no basis in reality, and I refuse to acknowledge it. Are you sure about that? I've never been so sure of anything in my life. You can't just suddenly appear in an altogether different location. That would just be totally... Excuse me, can you tell me which way is Hogwarts? Oh, it's over there. Thank you. I was taking my quantum physics degree on... How the hell did he get here? Get where? Yeah, doggins, get where? <laughs> Anymore. Some imagination, huh? <laughs> well, it's just past 8 o'clock and time for the corporate symbol on top of your island to explode. 